Hello all, and welcome to Spooky Season, and a summary for our Blood in the Streets, a Blades in the Dark campaign. So, the crew was approached while at a sandwich shop by a unsettling figure. Stiff limbs, confusing speech, offering expensive opera tickets as a reward. It wanted some of its stuff that seemed to have lost, a hat, a cane, and a blue bottle. The crew took the job, knowing that they could scalp these tickets to make a little bit of coin. And as the man started finishing up what he wanted, the ghost left the body, leaving a very confused, once-possessed person in his wake, causing a bit of startle at the sandwich shop, but the crew went on. Learning about the address and the apartment they would need to go it was a third floor in Char Hollow, a tenement building, simple enough to get in. Meanwhile, Max checked in with one of his friends, learning that recently a baker and an alchemist had died in that area, and were both found in the same house. There is belief that the baker may have owed some money, but to who? With that, the group felt they had what they needed. Slipping in nearly undetected, they made their way to the apartment. There, they found someone else going through the stuff, under sheets that were covered in a crime scene that was here. The group managed to subdue them and started searching, finding the hat and cane before this unknown messenger woke up. He managed to bolt out of the situation, making a run for it. The others let him free and continued the search, finding the blue bottle as the blue coats found them. Sensing a tense situation, they brought it off the blue coats. Blue coats smiled, took their money, and sent them on their way. And with that, the group reported to the Duchess, dropping off the items this ghost had wanted and asking some questions, learning a bit what was going on. The Dimmer sisters are upset that their agent was misled and the reconciled are quite happy to find people they can trust. And with that, we come to a close this week. I hope everyone has a safe week, enjoys the start of the spooky season, and I will see you all next time at the table. Bye for now.